Beauty in Poetry by Percy Bysshe Shelley. Poetry is indeed something divine. It is at once the center and circumference of knowledge. It is that which comprehends all science and that to which all science must be referred. It is at the same time the root and blossom of all other systems of thought. It is that from which all spring and that which adorns all and that which, if blighted, denies the fruit and the seed, and withholds from the barren world the nourishment and the succession of the scions of the tree of life. It is the perfect and consummate surface and bloom of all things. It is as the odor and the color of the rose to the texture of the elements which compose it, as the form and splendor of unfaded beauty to the secrets of anatomy and corruption. What were virtue, love, patriotism, friendship? What were the scenery of this beautiful universe which we inhabit? What were our consolations on this side of the grave? And what were our aspirations beyond it? If poetry did not ascend to bring light and fire from those eternal regions where the owl-winged faculty of calculation dare not ever soar. Poetry is the record of the best and happiest moments of the happiest and best minds. We are aware of evanescent visitations of thought and feeling sometimes associated with place or persons, sometimes regarding our own mind alone and always arising unforeseen and departing unbidden but elevating and delightful beyond all expression, so that even in the desire and the regret they leave, there cannot be but pleasure, participating as in the nature of its object. It is as it were the interpenetration of a diviner nature through our own, but its footsteps are like those of a wind over the sea, which the coming calm erases, and whose traces remain only as on the wrinkled sands which pave it. Poetry turns all things to loveliness. It exalts the beauty of that which is most beautiful, and it adds beauty to that which is most deformed. It marries exaltation and horror, grief and pleasure eternity and change. It subdues to union under its light yoke all irreconcilable things. It transmutes all that it touches, and every form moving within the radiance of its presence is changed by wondrous sympathy to an incarnation of the spirit which it breathes. Its secret alchemy turns to potable gold, the poisonous waters which flow from death through life. It strips the veil of familiarity from the world and lays bare the naked and sleeping beauty which is the spirit of its forms. Beauty in Poetry by Percy Bysshe Shelley